Hey everybody, I know this is not my usual background. Um, I know it looks like I've died, gone to heaven, I'm trying to convince God why I should be allowed in or something. There's actually a good reason as to why this is just a plain white background. I tried filming this video a couple of weeks ago and I spent a really long time on it. I wasn't in the greatest mental place and it was just the most depressing fucking video I've ever filmed in my life. And it had a black background and I was crying. And after I put it all together, I thought, you know what? For what the purpose of this video actually is, it's really not gonna convey how excited I am uh, for the news I have to tell you. As you all know, and as I like to remind you all of the time, I've made videos on here for about 12 years now and they've been like short, 10 minute, heavily edited bursts of my life. And I've really, really enjoyed doing that. And I will continue doing that in some form or another. However, in my usual fashionably late fashion, I've come to realize that this format is getting pretty suffocated on YouTube and it's getting harder and harder to find and enjoy content on here. When you've got channels that make videos filled with disinformation and you've got millionaire YouTubers who pretend that they care and they're giving back and of course they're fucking not. It's just started to get a little bit crap and I can't change that. And I'd love to believe that I'm like a yeah for justice, but I'm starting to feel like the way forward of entertaining people online is more in live streaming. So there's the announcement. Um, in a short while, I will be officially and finally starting my Twitch channel. I only opened it like eight years ago, so it's pretty good going for me, to be honest. This is something that I've wanted to do for a really, really long time, and I've been putting it off, and I've been scared to do it. I don't really know why I've been scared for so long, but that's really getting replaced with excitement now. So here's the idea. I'm gonna start live streaming on Twitch. I'm gonna try my best to start a schedule that works for everybody. Yes, I know, a schedule. Can she keep up with it? Yes, she can! Have faith! Or d <laughs> no, it is something that I really, really want to do. So I'm setting everything up. I'm doing some research because I don't know what the fuck I'm doing yet. I just want it to be a place where we can hang, chat, um, chill, tell stories. I can give advice to any of you guys if you think I'm good at giving advice. I want to do things like reviewing music and talking about music with you guys. I want to be playing some games. There's, there's a lot of ideas firing off in my head about what we can do. It feels like the possibilities are endless. So this is where I'm really gonna need your help. I would like to know what you guys would watch, what you would tune in for. Do you just want to see what happens? You just want to hang out and, you know, we can just decide on stream. Would you tune in more for gaming stuff? Would you just want to see me just telling, telling stories and, and just talking with you guys? I don't know. So let me know, please, in the comments below. That would be fantastic. I have my shows in Newport in Wales and London coming up this Friday and Saturday on my past and present tour. And just after that, I have a couple of family commitments. But that takes us into early November, just before my 33rd birthday. Ah, so I'm hoping to start streaming on Twitch at the beginning of November, essentially. The link is down below. I think it's twitch.tv forward slash Emma Blackery TV. Someone stole my name, okay? I would want it back. And one thing that I also think is gonna be quite interesting is seeing how far we can take this. Because now I'm gonna show you what I'm gonna be streaming on. <laughs> so, switching over to my phone camera, here we have Emma's computer of doom. Let's start with the two monitors, which are not the same size, and only one works as HDMI. The other one seems to only work as VGA which is not very good. Audio interface, that works absolutely fine. Great microphone, use that a lot. Not really fussed about these speakers, that's fine. Still have my old mouse in 2014. That seems to be working great. Had to buy a new cheap keyboard because the Razer keyboard I had uh, had been gathering dust for so long that all of these stopped working even after I cleaned them all. I pulled them all out and everything. Uh, the space bar was broken, so that's not great. Moving on down here, um, this case was white once when I bought this PC in 2015. Now, when I say, and please, oh Jesus, that's bad. Now, when I say 2015, I ordered it from PC Specialist, as you can see here. I bought it pre-made, um, made for pretty decent enough gaming back in 2015. In the last nine years, how much of this do you think I've changed? How many things do you think I've replaced or upgraded? If your answer is none, you are absolutely correct. This was pretty mid back in 2015. So, <laughs> I'm really not that certain of what this is gonna run. I've kept this on Windows 10 because I do not trust it with Windows 11 at all. So on Windows 10, I have extremely old graphics card in here. Um, it's not great but we're gonna roll with it because it's what I have. I'm gonna be able to use OBS. Maybe 
maybe play the, I, don't, I don't think even this thing can handle minecraft anymore but we shall soon see i hope you can see my predicament and thank you for coming to my ted talk and again please ignore my cable management because i don't know what i'm doing but it's gonna be fun right back to you white backdrop so that's gonna be interesting it needs a hell of a lot of improvements doesn't it uh, <laughs> so if you guys tune in and this all works out really well and I'm enjoying myself and you guys are enjoying the streams Then maybe I should start looking bit by bit at upgrading my PC um, It's 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 like a game in itself really isn't it? Let's see how far we can soup up Emma's PC <laughs> and if there's reason to then I will look at getting some upgrades um, <laughs> I just think this whole journey is gonna be a lot of fun. I'm gonna learn a lot along the way. I know very, very little. Um, I'm having a little bit of guidance, uh, but any advice would be appreciated. I can't wait to see you guys over there. This will probably be the last video until then, um, but I will let you know when I start streaming. I hope you guys have been well, and hopefully I will see you guys on my tour dates this Friday and Saturday. I also have a couple of dates that had to be rescheduled to February, and they are in Glasgow and Manchester, so come along, um, buy tickets, I'll leave them down below. You can hear me play music from my past and my present, hence why it's got the past and present tour. I'm playing songs that I haven't played in a very long time and might not play again for a long time, so grab your tickets down below. There's a few, there's a few VIP upgrades available. But thank you so much for watching, I will see you on twitch.tv forward slash Emma Blackery TV. Give me my name back. But until then, guys, I love you all and I shall catch you later.